everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing an update of what's in my nappy slash diaper bag. If you haven't seen my other what's in my nappy bag video, I'll link it down below and in the cards up here. Be sure to check that one out as well. Um, it is different to the bag I have now, but it is a backpack style. So if you're interested in that sort of bag, then definitely go and check that video out as well. So let's get into what is in my new nappy bag and what my nappy bag now looks like. And this is it here. So I went for a black nappy bag this time. It is still a backpack style. So obviously it has the straps at the back. But I went for black just because I found the other nappy bag that I had did um, show up a lot of stains and dirt and stuff like that because it was a lighter colour. So I thought black would be um, a better alternative. And this one has some black hardware details on there so black zippers these little tassel things on the zippers which are really cute i really like this because it's nice and simple classic clean it's like a plaid leather material as well so really durable and strong and yeah let's get into it i did buy this bag at tk maxx if you're interested i'm not sure if they still have them because i did buy this several months ago what i really like about this bag is a really cool feature that it has that i haven't seen in other nappy bags in the market before and it's this front section here so from a glance it looks like a normal bag with a front zipper and then the top section but what it has is these little extra zippers on the side here and what you can actually do with these zippers is actually unclip it completely or unzip it completely and it detaches from the bag I can do this one handed it's a little bit hard so then you're left with like two separate bags this is, turns into like a wristlet um, it has a part of the back where you can detach a strap and I do have the strap as well it came with a bag and then you're also left with still a really good decent backpack and you still have a front pocket here to put any belongings that you want in the front so you can carry the bag as is or you can attach this little wristlet to it and wear it as a full like with the two piece um, so I found this really handy because I can keep my belongings in here so I can keep my you know credit card or phone and lipsticks or whatever I need for myself personally and grab this if I'm just running to the store quickly without the kids and I don't have to carry the whole bag with me but if I'm you know going out and you know running errands with the kids I'll take the whole bag and I'll attach the wristlet part of the bag on there as well so I have my belongings and the kids belongings as well so while I have this out I might as well show you what I carry in the front here is my phone of course this is just the iPhone 6 and that's my case hand sanitizer for the kids and myself. I've got a couple of lipsticks, lip balms and things like that that I carry in here. Two lipsticks are these ones here. They're pretty much the same color. This is my go-to lip color. Um, this one is Samba, I think Australia's. Yeah, Samba Australia's brand. And this is the color. The other one is an Essence Natural Beauty which is this one here again very very similar I go for these colors all the time um, I love my pinks and kind of like my lips but better colors so that's why I carry these two and also inside this little wristlet I've got this really handy two-in-one a lip balm and a hand cream in one so this one's from typo I think it's in the peach yeah peach um, scent so what you do is unscrew the top so this is the lip balm and then if you unscrew the whole lid this is the actual hand cream so by having this I can actually carry a hand cream plus a lip balm all in one and the last thing I have in this little wristlet is just a travel perfume that I carry with me in case I need an extra little, you know, spritz. <laughs> um, this is just the Avon Fire Away um, perfume scent. My mum is actually an Avon representative, so I buy these from her. And I find these little travel um, bottles are really handy. And it actually is like a spray. Spray, not a roll-on, which I prefer. So, 
and this is just like a floral smell I love this smell it's very girly and sweet so that is all I have in the little wristlet part of it so now let's go into the actual bag itself and I'll show you what I have. I should mention that if you haven't seen my other videos, you probably don't know that I have two kids. Um, my eldest is four years old and my youngest is 20 months. So this bag is for both of them. And I like to keep what I carry around minimal. Um, I don't like to lug around unnecessary things. I found as they do get older, you don't need as many things, which is great. But the more I put in here, the heavier it's going to get, the more things I have to unpack and yeah. So I do the side pockets first. It does have two side pockets here. They don't have a clasp or a zip or anything like that. Um, so you've got to be careful what you put in there in case, you know, it falls out and you lose it. The first thing I keep in here is just my sunglasses. These are the ones I'm currently wearing. And I have a spare dummy for my daughter. And this is just her dummy cover that has fallen off, obviously, off that dummy. And that is all I have in that pocket. On the other side here, I have some wipes. These are the sticky fingers, hand and face wipes that I carry and I find having it on the side pocket rather than in the actual bag is really handy because um, I can just pull it out from the side instead of having to dig into the big section of the bag. So I always keep this in the side pocket. I can always grab it quickly and easily and not having to pull everything out. And that is actually all I have in that side pocket as well. So I just keep the wipes in there. And I don't actually have anything in this pocket here because like I said, I usually have the wristlet attached to this. So I don't find the need to put anything more in there because everything else is in this little zip up bag. So let's see what's inside. The first thing is, and you would have seen this in my other video um, of, you know, what's in my nappy bag. And I still carry it with me and I love it. And it is the nappy, um, well, it's called nappy changing mats. This is the one I got from Cotton On almost two years ago now. I'm pretty sure they still have it. It's one of those staples that they have there. But I really like it because it does tie up. And it has a really cute print. And then on the back it's got like that um, kind of like a towel material. I don't know if you can see that on camera. And inside it's like that, got that waterproof lining in the middle of that. So I really like this. Adrian is obviously still in nappies. She's only 20 months old. So I still do need this when I change her nappies at the shops. So I don't like to lay her on those changing mats they have there. You know, some of them have just paper that you pull out and you lay your baby on that. I find that's really hard and cold. So I like to lay her on this instead. Um, and I know this is clean. And as soon as I bring it home, I just put it into the washing machine and clean it and then put it back in my bag for the next use so um, definitely is a must for me I still carry that with me also inside my bag I just have a bunch of nappies of course like I said she's still in nappies so these are a must um, I'm currently using the baby love nappies I like I rotate from these and huggies they're my two favorites at the moment um, we just happen to have baby love because they were on sale so I just carry a couple. I have four. This is way too many. I just stocked up my bag not long ago. Usually I only take two or three because she doesn't go through that many changes. Um, but I always get paranoid that I don't pack enough nappies. And it depends on how long we're going to be going out for. Um, will depend on how many nappies I pack. But if I pack four, I know I'm safe and this will be more than enough for her. So four nappies. And then, of course, to go with nappies, you need wipes. These are the ones I still use, and I was using these in my previous video. You can get these from Big W for super inexpensive. I think they've actually dropped the prices of these ones, so super affordable. Great wipes, in my opinion, because they're not too thin, not too thick, and they're just the right consistency for me. So, definitely love these. Also, in this compartment, I have my wallet. 
nothing too fancy here it's just a plain white wallet that i can okay so that's all that's in the actual big compartment of it there is a couple of pockets inside the bag that i'll show you now so in here there's a little there's two little sections that you can put small things into so this is where i typically keep their snacks so i've got a bunch of snacks in here i've got some crackers and dip some fruit bars and Sultana, these are their favorite snacks. And that's all I have in there. And then you also have this little zipper, zipper section here that you can put stuff in. I have actually this little nappy bag detacher thing that I hang on that. So in here I just have the nappy bags. So in case she does a number two in her nappy, I've got somewhere to put that stinky nappy and throw it in the bin. And then in this little pocket here is mainly things um, that I don't want the kids to get into. So I have some Panadol for me, a small packet of tissues, deodorant, this is like a travel size Nivea, and just a pen because you never know when you're going to need a pen. And that is actually it. So the whole bag is now empty. Also normally carry in their water bottles as well, which I don't have in the bag at the moment because I've just taken them out. But usually there is two drink bottles in there as well. And that's the end of my video. I hope you have enjoyed watching. If you have, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below to see more videos from me. And don't forget to click the little notification bell if you haven't already to be sure you can be notified of every video that I post. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.